Essentially, I am a construction worker. I've worked in construction for over 30 years. I'm from the north side of the city, Bob and Bread, Dublin. Working on construction sites and in construction, I see the exploitation of workers on a continuous basis. Certainly over the last 10, 15 years, the working conditions of construction workers have decreased. I think it's important that if, you know the issues of exploitation, not just of construction workers, but all workers through bogus self-employment or whatever other abuses that are out there, that they should be you know called out and publicised and basically denounced. I've always been an activist in, in the social movement, in the left-wing left -wing movement. The whole platform, the whole project of People Before Profit was grassroots up sort of organisation, that's the sort of organisation that appealed to me. Uh, Council Andrew Keegan, People for Profit, representing the, the Finglas Ballymun Ward. Priorities coming into the, the next general election and for the next five years if elected will certainly be housing. Try as best we can to get public housing built by the council and uh, the funding put into that to, to get rid of the housing crisis. Secondly, with the other issues, investment in, in youth centres, there's been a massive wind down and disinvestment in their communities, both in Fingers and Ballymun. Youth centres are being, the budgets are being slashed. Thirdly, just a, which I think may be key, is for communities to establish or to reinvigorate their residence associations right across the, the constituency. People power, we would always use people power, we'd use it in the uh, repeal the 8th referendum, we use people power in the massive uh, demonstrations against uh, the homeless crisis. So we need people power in our areas. People for Profit will be standing over 60 candidates nationally. We would want you to, to consider people for profit as a left alternative. So vote for people for profit, whatever constituency you are in.